G'day fellas and welcome back to the 5 year rebuilds. Today we're doing cow. Got the jersey on, everything like that. It's going to be interesting because the back 12 is tough. You can see that we have an 84 offense, a 92 defense, but a 77 offense. So I don't really know what's going on in California if you guys can't produce quarterbacks or something. But hey, this is going to be tough. We're not going to be able to drop any points on anybody. So let's check out this team real quick. What do we have to work with? I'm not expecting a lot offensively, but defensively, we could probably... Be Look at this. That's not that good, man. We got some studs. Linebacker DT. Hopefully they don't leave. That would suck. But let's get into recruiting here. All right, checking out the class. So we got a couple wide receivers. This is good for us. A lot of really talented players interested in joining our squad. Any offensive lineman I can get, I'm getting them right now. All right, let's start with that. All right, we got an athlete linebacker. We got some studs here that we could add to the board i don't know if i can trust this guy he looks all right but 80 woo okay team's coming together right now we're going to be taking these low lock players brady robinson is actually a quarterback i like him a lot hopefully we can snag him even though he's 69 overall gotta start somewhere and this is our regular class right here this is who we're going after got some offensive linemen that look kind of kind of nice got a cornerback de and a wide receiver I think this class is going to be really solid for the first couple years, man. We got Carl Allen, Raymond Witherspoon. So we're helping that offensive team out a lot. That, that, that's what's struggling. Ah, uh, running back. I guess. I guess I'll take a quarterback. I'll take an offensive lineman if they're going to give it. All right. So these are our new guys that we found. Got to be honest with you. I'm not really feeling any of them. All right. Looks like we got all of our people. Look at that. We even got Brady Robinson, the quarterback. Ah, we go three and nine though. That's, I mean, I'm not really digging that. All right, let's check this out. Uh, don't tell me we got fired. We're safe for now. Our target to win per year is nine. That's a lot of expectations, Brody. I'm not going to lie about that. No freshman decided to leave. Wow, fellas, that's kind of rare, isn't it? All right, we might get shitter, but that's fine. That's good. How come we're leading so much for these guys? Let me go ahead and drop a cool 3K in both of them. All right, this class is really good, man. A lot of offensive linemen. We've got a crazy good running back in Charles Coleman. Finish it off with these guys. Oh, man. Oh, Justin Anderson is a quarterback. Sign the number one class. Let's go, man. And look at that. Two five-star players, ten four-star players. That's going to get us the number one class in the country on a three and nine record. Yep. All right, let's go ahead. Snag. I need different positions, bro. Like linebackers, cornerbacks, tight end would be good. Marcus DeLuca. Man, we are getting some hot, stinky trash right now. What is this? Why is everybody so bad? I guess we got to rock with it now. So our offense goes up, but our defense drops down. We were an A minus, I think. Now a B. We can still bounce back. We're coming off an amazing season one where we signed the number one class. And it looks like it's going to be more of the same as there's nobody really contesting us for first right now. All right, who's the best athlete here? Six foot six runs a four, four, four. I'm taking Ben Estes, boys. Ben Estes is going to be a 79 overall, bro fantastic stats he's a wide receiver bet so this is what the board is looking like in year two we are not stepping down we are trying to go back to back rank one classes again we're targeting things that we need we're not just going after the best talent but so far it's looking really promising tight end cornerback another tight end linebackers running back for shits and gigs and this ben estes guy this guy's a freak 92 excel 89 speed 87 route running and the dude is six foot six that's a beast right there trevor beverly all right i like that class a lot man we didn't sign a lot of players we didn't even get six wins but we could add from this i don't think this class is going to be close to number one man Ooh, security is low man please don't let us get fired all right again no freshmen no sophomores leaving the squad cal might be one of my favorite rebuilds yet the way this is going i'm liking this all right, we have a lot of people I want to get right here. Let's start by going a thousand and everybody we want. Oh, I don't know if I like that, but we're going to rock with this and just fingers crossed, mate, that we can pick up some of them. All right, we only got three of them, so we didn't sign that many people. In saying that, we still got a top 25 class, though. We got the 18th best class, nine four stars. Ah, man, that's a lot of one stars, though. Still top 25, but 
All right, so we got some five-star players interested in joining. One thing we definitely got to get is defensive tackle, defensive ends, offensive linemen, bro. But this is crazy. We got a lot of prospects, man. A lot of really solid prospects here. I might even fill up this board. Look at these four stars, bro. My goodness, they aren't playing with us this year. Man, this is not looking good right here. Season three, I believe. I reckon even though we don't have the lead on some of these guys like Shane Frederick, I reckon we're going to be able to take the lead on him come the end of the season. And then we also pick up Paul Leonard and George Taylor. Fingers crossed that we're going to be able to sign them by the end of this season. Fingers crossed. All right, so we pick up Gary Skinner, Joe Steffens, Ryan Callahan, Titus Simmons, Chip Sanders. All right, we're making progress. We have a 2-6 and six record. We're probably going to get fired. But again, progress is progress. Okay, it's what I can at least tell myself. I don't remember what we need exactly, but I'm just going to take the gooniest goons I can find in every aspect. Like this athlete, I'm going to take him. All right, so we pick up Shane Frederick, yada, yada, yada. We got some nice high 70 overalls. Don't get fired. We went three and nine. Ah, we unlock insta commit though, which is fantastic. We were halfway to getting a bowl game. I knew it. We were going to get fired. Wow. Yeah, look at that. We went 3 9, 5 and 7, and 3 and 9. That's, hey, not many coaches are hanging around after that. Let's just be honest. Ah, uh, hold on. What team were we again? Wow, Cal is a two star school now. Oh, that's not good. Please, no freshmen. Please, no. Okay, we're good. We're good. Can we get some transfers, maybe? Oh, I'll take it. Hey, I'm not a. I'll take a 62. My ego is not that big. Where do our advantages lay, though? I'm going to say, like, 6K in a Clarence. And I mean, that's a lot of high 70s and 80. Like, that's good. All right, so we pick up Austin McGee and Clarence Williams to round out the season. That is a top five class. I'm recording this like five or so days later from the last one that you guys saw. So I'm a little bit behind on how our classes have been going. We're a two-star school. The overall is amazing. Two five stars, eight four stars. All in all, I'm really happy with this class. We had a lot of 80s. For the, uh, I'll quickly show you. We brought in a brand new tight end who's an 80. A lot of 70s, high 70s, linebackers, cornerbacks. We basically went all defense. All defense and it paid off tremendously. Don't ask me why there's a 49 overall free safety. I don't know. I do not know what to tell you there. So in season four, as you can see from the team needs, uh, we are cool. We do not need a quarterback. We have one of those and we do need a center, but I hardly think that it warrants recruiting an entire season just to get a center when the computer could do that. As I said, the team is completely done. And I actually looked, I haven't recorded this in probably a week and a half. So I have no idea. I think this is season four, I'm pretty sure it is. But one thing I know for a fact is that the team is in a very good spot, even though we came off, I think it was a three and nine record. Looking at this, I mean, there's a lot of really talented players to still scoop up. So let's get the computer on these dudes ASAP. Even take a kicker. Oh yeah, this is great. I'll take all this. Thank you very much. I've also gone ahead and redshirted the only two people that we need to get. I'm just curious to see what our overall is going to be. Because when I looked at the team, we were good. Like, we were really good. So in season four, we are B+, B+, and B+. Ah, I mean, season five is going to be a banger, bud. If we're 90 overall across the board now, it's not the greatest, but... Hey, all I want from this season is a bowl game. That is it. Let's see how we go in season four. Computer did a pretty good job. They got the center that we needed, 80 overall. We got some more offensive linemen for backups, I guess. An 86 overall kicker. Man, I... How did we win two games, bro? Oh, this is what I'm talking about, man. I don't like rebuilding teams in the Pac-12 because I get hacked. I can't believe with a 90 overall team, we went two and 10. I've never seen that happen before. That's disgusting. All I'm gonna say is if we somehow manage to flip this team from two and 10 to like a 10 and two team, this is probably gonna be the most successful rebuild ever. Wow, is this the second time we got fired? The second time we got fired. <laughs> After one season, we got fired. Oh, man. I can't believe that we got fired twice in one rebuild. That's a yikes. So I get this question like a million times. So I'll just show you for the millionth time how I do it. So what we want to do is go back to the Pac-12, go to head coach, go down to the team you really want to take over. In this case, it'll be head coach for... Cal, and as you can see down the bottom, it says create coach R1. You click R1, go to create a new coach just like this. 
Unfortunately, you have to reset up whatever you had. I know it can be quite annoying, but we're going to rock with the air raid. And then bang, continue. And just like that, you forcibly take over. Just like that. Bang. Done. You sign the contract. Now, that's not it completely done. You still have to go and go to your other team. So for us, we were fired and sent to Eastern Michigan. So what you want to now do is click on the other guy that got fired with X or A, I guess, for Xbox. And then set, make this a computer controlled coach. And now you're officially back on the team you were fired from simple as that now let's check players leaving oh nice no freshmen are going to be going that's excellent so what i find really ironic is that despite being a one star school you heard correct we are a one star school now and the computer recruited <laughs> even though i set up the people they'd go after we still got a top 10 class and eighth to be exact we got no five stars but that's a pretty good amount i just find that to be crazy don't you i find it crazy so in season five, the big reveal, we are A plus, A plus, A plus. It worked like a charm, fellas. I knew it. We are 97 overall. This is obviously good enough to win a national championship. Obviously, that probably won't happen because whenever you do a Pac-12 team, <laughs> Pac-12, you can forget about going to the natty. But like, look, we have an 89 quarterback. Running backs are really nice. 99 XL, 99 speed. 75 fullback. Receivers are okay. Tight ends are okay. But the offensive line, mate, look at that. We got two 90s and eight. 88, 97 defensive tackle, two 90 plus linebackers. The team is solid, mate. 95 strong safety. This team is good enough to get to the natty or at least get a bowl game, bro. And let's see what happens. All right, here we go. I noticed that we beat Stanford. I think they were ranked six at the time. I have not seen the rest of the season though. Eight and four. Hey, I'll take it. We're qualified after that dub against Stanford. 31 to 21. We knocked them off, mate. So at least, I mean, this is not like conference championship great, but <laughs> I'll take it, you know? Like, after the crappy rebuild we've had, I would definitely take 8 and 4, man. No doubt. And we're the best 8 and 4 team in the nation, hands down. 97 overall. As a base? Oh, it's over. We're going to be versus 7 and 5 North Carolina. That's not a bad game at all. We're obviously miles above them in terms of overall, which is good. Let's check out these season stats real quick though we had 30,000 yards 37 touchdowns 19 picks so our 90 overall quarterback i mean he didn't play all that amazing still good though rushing in nothing crazy receiving in nothing crazy was there anything or any play that stood out braxton our outside linebacker stood out 93 tackles amongst a lot the most i've seen six and a half sacks to oren patu braxton also had five and a half sacks five and a half to michael smith this average man a lot of picks though that's 12 picks i'll take that this was a very below average 97 overall performance i don't know how i feel about that at least we can finish it off the right way we bounce back from a terrible terrible first four seasons let's jump into this game uh okay here we go <laughs> we're playing at utep stadium as well in el paso it is uh this is this is definitely the desert okay i will say in advance i do have some audio issues but I apologize if it's annoying in the background. Crowey's onto it. That's really nice. Let's go, Coleman up the sideline. Nobody's going to be able to catch him. The first play. That's what happens when you have 99 speed in Excel, bro. That's exactly what happens right there. Yes, I fixed the audio. Let's go, boys. All right. After that gorgeous kick return, let's see if this California team can uh, bounce back one way or another. 10 to 7. Okay. Okay. We're losing. I don't think we're going to get a pun return here, but I'll try. Oh, wait. This is us? Oh, crap. We're on offense. <laughs> oh, jeez. What have I gotten myself into? No running back out here. Take off. Let's go, quarterback. That's man coverage. Oh, got it with the step back. Jeez, Mark Crooks. Let's go, man. That was a perfectly executed step back cheese. Got him good. Fourth and two, boys. We get another chance. Is that Coleman back there? It is. Oh, I'm so excited. Come on, man. Let's get this pun return. Go Coleman. Look at the speed. It's too easy. It's too overpowered. But, whoa. Okay. I didn't like this. I feel like North Carolina is going to come back. There we go. Let's go tight end. Good job. 
They're blitzing. Uh oh, I hope they know what they're doing. I feel like there's gonna be a touchdown. Nope, they knew exactly what they were doing. We get sacked. Another blitz? Come on. Let's go, Coleman! Ah! Dang it! Oh! <laughs> I simulated third and 17 and we scored. You love to see it, mate. That's excellent. I can't believe that happened. I think they turned the ball over. That's fine. There we go. That's... Coleman dropped it! Bro, are you joking? Come on, Coleman. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, Coleman. Cut him back in. Oh, oh! Bro, that would have been so hectic if he scored off that. Man, speed on running backs is next level overpowered, bro. There we go. Keeping the drive alive. Look at that. We scored. This Calif I love this California team, man. This is definitely, like, despite the record, one of the most underrated teams we've ever done. Ever. Unbelievable. Last play of the game, we're in the human centipede formation. So we have enough blocks. We got the blocks! Coleman, ready? Ah, I tried to juke. It was a bit too late. Wow, what a game. That was actually really fun. And we hit 100 yards on that play too. Well, that was the California rebuild. I don't know how I feel about that one. Still one of the most underrated teams we ever had. Like, I don't know. But yeah, if you made it as far into the video, you are the real MVP. Hope the rest of your day is awesome. And from me personally, I'm out. Peace. <laughs>